Okay, this is for Aries. Aries, we got the Ten of Cups here. So you're focusing on your family life here, but you're heartbroken about it. And I do see an opportunity here being offered to you. This could be on camera, online. Because you feel left out in the cold with some kind of uncertain self-employment. So you're making a decision. Concerning some kind of property. All your emotional and material needs will be met. You're making a decision here concerning some kind of property or inheritances. Um, all of your emotional and material needs will be met and you're focusing on your wish fulfillment. Some of you may get some good news concerning your property. Yeah, you're focusing on your independence, Aries, because somebody's not telling you the truth about some kind of unfinished business, Aries. Because they have too much baggage. This person has trust issues. They're not willing to take a leap of faith here. And this is leaving you with unfinished business. And they're not telling you the truth. Could be dealing with a Capricorn. A Leo. A Scorpio. A Taurus. An Aquarius. And another Aries. But Aries, you're stressed out about this. So I see you taking some kind of trip. You're trying to move on here because things are turning into your favor. You're being treated unfairly. Somebody's making plans to get together and not showing up. If somebody's non-committal to this situation, they're treating you unfairly. Could be dealing with a Taurus, Scorpio, Leo, Aquarius, Libra, and another Aries. Aries. Yeah, and you feel attacked feel overwhelmed this person's very unorganized this person does not act logically and they're treating you unfairly but things are turning into your favor Aries so you need to get more information some of you could be spying but you need to get more information because you're not sticking around. It's making you feel stuck. Could be down with the Pisces, an Aquarius, and an Aries. But this person has too much baggage, so you need to get more information. Yeah. I see you taking the trip. Moving on. Crossing over water here. Getting mentored. You may be dealing with a Virgo. But I see you getting mentored on a situation so you can move on because somebody's failing to end a painful cycle. Somebody could be failing to end a painful addiction. So you're getting mentored because this is making you feel stuck and you don't want to stick around. It's a temporary delay though. Yeah, you're trying to take back control of your life and move things forward here. You may be dealing with a cancer. But you're taking a trip and you're moving forward victoriously. Yeah, because you're having anxiety here. Some of you could be having some kind of stress or anxiety over a vehicle or some kind of trip that you're taking. But you have a lot of options, Aries, and that's making you confused because you don't see any growth with this person. You may be dealing with a Libra, a Taurus, a mother. Could be having stress or anxiety due to a mother. Yeah, you're sad and depressed. Because you don't see any growth with this situation. You see this as a burden. You're having stress-related health concerns.
I do see a positive resolution to a conflict here, though. And you're moving forward victoriously. Some of you are in the spotlight. You get a lot of attention. Some of you are in the public eye. Yeah, you're moving forward victoriously here. I do see you coming into union with someone because you're sad and depressed and you see this as a burden. So you're walking away. You're walking away. You're coming into union with someone here because you feel like it's not too much work. You could be getting gifts of money for your time and effort. You could be receiving loans or paying off debts. So you're holding back. You're saving your money. Because somebody's playing mind games with you and they're wanting to win at all costs. So I see you taking action, standing in your own power. You may be an entrepreneur. See so you discussing plans with your relatives here. But you feel like you're being treated unfairly. Yeah, and somebody's not willing to make the changes that they need to make or step out of their comfort zone. And they're playing mind games about it, which is an unwise choice. And I see you collaborating here with somebody, but they're only collaborating here for their own selfish needs. They're not willing to build a solid foundation. They're not willing to be a team player. They're not willing to put in the work. This person's lazy. So you're releasing any kind of attachments that you have over this. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, a Virgo, a Leo, and a Sagittarius, and a Libra. Scorpio, Taurus, Aquarius. Leo. Yeah, you're trying to handle things in a kind and understanding manner. You could be dealing with the Virgo. Okay, yeah, you're trying to handle things in a kind and understanding manner. Because somebody's acting recklessly. They're being a player. They're acting recklessly with their spending habits, their addictions. They're not willing to put in the work. This person's not a team player. They do sloppy work. And they only collaborate for their own selfish needs. This is causing problems, sadness, depression, problems with children. There's going to be bad weather due on this day. This could be due to the bad weather. There's a delay in communication here. This could be concerning a child or because somebody's depressed or acting recklessly. With their spending habits or an addiction, so you're making a decision to end some kind of partnership or contract here, but you're trying to be kind and understanding about this. Yeah, because a relationship between you and someone else is growing closer. You may be dealing with a Scorpio, a Leo, or a Sagittarius, and a Virgo. So you're waiting. There's a temporary pause in action. It's unnecessary worry. Could be waiting for some kind of money here. This is making you very emotional because some kind of deception was revealed. And somebody's having bad memories from the past about this deception. And the problems with children. Somebody's having bad memories from the past about how they were acting recklessly with their spending habits or an addiction. You're having bad memories from the past about how you've been being treated unfairly. How hard you've worked to get where you are. How stressed out you are. And there's a lack of counsel here. And you have the Midas touch, Aries. Somebody's acting aggressive. They're acting manipulative. They're abusing their power. So I see you completing some kind of project in your home environment here. You're going to be getting an invitation to some kind of social event here. This could be to your home. But you don't want to hold back anymore because somebody's spending too much money. And somebody got caught lying, cheating, or stealing. Because this person's not willing to make the changes that they need to make. So you're trying to balance out your emotions. A decision's being made against someone here, either not to change jobs, not to change locations, but a decision's being made against someone here, and it looks like you're trying to balance out your emotions. You have one foot in and one foot out of this situation. You're testing out the waters here. 
Could be dealing with the Sagittarius or a Scorpio, a Libra. Yeah, so I see you taking a break here. Some of you are exhausted. Yeah, some of you are exhausted and you're not ready. You don't have all the resources and the materials that you need to have to manifest what it is that you want. It could be you or the person that you're talking, you know, of. But, um... Somebody's trying to manipulate the situation and it's causing arguments. Because they're not willing to put in the work. They're not willing to buckle down and get things done. This person doesn't honor their commitments. This is causing arguments. This is making you feel not ready. This is exhausting you. And this person's not even expressing themselves. They're not apologizing to you. They're not reaching out to you. And you're not healing from this because you're not on the right path. This is causing conflict. This is causing arguments, jealousy, competition. <clears throat> and you're trying to get yourself unstuck from this. So there is an offer that's going to be made here. It's an inflow of abundance. You could be stressing out about this offer. But this is something that you have to work for. But you're keeping it to yourself that you're stressing out about this offer here. There is a new person that stirred up your romantic feelings, but you're keeping it to yourself because you're struggling to get yourself unstuck from a situation. Some of you could be getting a new home. Some of you could be struggling back and forth whether or not you want to get a new home. There may be news of the birth of a baby here. But don't give up, Aries. You need to take action without fear. Nurture yourself and take action because you don't want to miss out on this opportunity. But something's causing conflict here and this is pissing you off because you're not paying attention. This is somebody in your family environment here. This person's blaming you. This person does not have the same values as you. So I see you discussing some kind of new business ideas or maybe a passionate new beginning. Someone may be pissed off here about a passionate new beginning. Someone may be pissed off at about, about um, a situation at home concerning their family because yet you don't have the same values as this person. And this person's blaming you. This person only does charity work here for their own selfish needs. This person's emotionally unavailable, emotionally codependent. And there's going to be an unexpected bill here because of this. Because you got some kind of bad advice. So I see you moving forward victoriously here, but you have your guard up. You're trying to protect what it is that you have created, and you're having bad health over this contract or partnership that ended. And it's affecting your health. You could be dealing with a Gemini, an Aries, a Scorpio, and a Cancer. What else for Aries? Aries. Okay, Aries. You can expect powerful change, but you need to show the world the real you. And you need to balance out your spirituality and practicality because your emotions are running high. You need to surrender to the divine. You may be dealing with an Aquarius and a Pisces. But you need to surrender to the divine because your emotions are running high. And you need to expect powerful change, but you have to show the world who you truly are. Good luck, Aries.